In this video, I show you how to customize Chrome. If you're new to the channel, please go down below and hit that subscribe button. And once you have subscribed, please go and leave a like as well. I really do appreciate it. And please watch this video right until the end so you know all of the different edits and effects and themes you can go and add to Google Chrome. So without any further ado, let's go and jump into this guide. I'm now on Google Chrome and let's go into customizing this. So all you want to do is come to Google and you want to simply go and search for something called Nighttap. Now Nighttap is a Chrome extension which is going to allow us to customize Google a ton and I'll be showing you exactly how to do that so do keep watching. So let's just go and search for Nighttap just like so. Then you want to make sure you select the one which has the Chrome web store. So click Nighttap and it's going to take you here. So as you can see, there's over 100,000 users. It's quite highly rated as well. So let's go and download this. So of course, come over to the right where it says add to Chrome and simply go and click on it. And then it's gonna go and say checking and you're gonna go and get this pop up here. And it's gonna say it can replace the page you see when opening a new tab. So go and click add extension and then it's gonna take a minute to load. And then in the top right, you're gonna get this pop up here saying night tab has been removed from Chrome. And you can manage your extensions by clicking extensions in the tools menu. And then what you want to do is open a new tab and then it's gonna take us to here. It's gonna say change back to Google. This page was changed by night tab extension. So of course, because we actually want to do this, you want to go and click keep it. So here it is and let's go and customize this. So the first thing you want to do is come over to the right hand side. We've got this color here. So you want to simply click on it. And then of course we can change this to any color we want just like so and we can go and click off it again as well um so let's go and do like a green i reckon and then it's going to go and change all of this to green and sort of all the sort of the main bits to green and then you can go and click on this plus here as well and that's going to allow us to create new groups and new bookmarks which is useful and then you can go and click on this pencil tool and there are a ton more options as you can see we can go and change the order of these we can go and remove them completely if we want to so i could go and move this amazon bookmark um, and you can also go and change what this is, which it says. So to do that, you simply click on this pen tool here and then I can go and change the, the cool stuff name by clicking here. So I, I could just call this random like so and then go and click save and then it's gonna go and save it just like that. So there we can go right over to the far right. We've got the settings cog and this is where you can change a lot of stuff. So you can change the whole present. So we could go and change it to comet say and then it's gonna change this awesome comet effect. And this is sort of where the main, the main stuff is and it gets really, really cool. And you can change the font. You can go and change the shade. There's literally everything you can imagine you can change as well as the background. So you can upload stuff and use images honestly really really cool and then we can go and change the layout as well so of course you can go and change the size of everything which is awesome um, and you can go and change the width of things so there is so much stuff you can go and change as i did say we can go and change the bookmark stuff so click here and then you can change literally all of this awesome stuff here and there's so much to sort of go into so the best thing i find is when you've got a, a tool like this it's sort of just go and explore it yourself i can go and show you the main sort of things you can go and change um, but overall the best way to learn it is to go and look at it all basically and once you're happy with the look you just go and press on this x in the top right and then that's literally it. and every time you go and open a new tab just like so it's going to come and update it for you if you ever want to remove it come to the top right in chrome click on the puzzle piece and then all you want to do is look for night tab come and click on these three dots here more actions and then just go and click remove from chrome and then all you want to do is go and click remove again and then it's going to take you back to your usual google home page if you found this guide useful please go down below and hit the subscribe button leave a like for more i'll catch you in the next one peace